God that I've been introduced to your ministry. Yes. The reason I'm writing you is actually twofold. As I've had, I, have a, I have a request and I have a question. All right. I was raised a Catholic. Mm-hmm. I was baptized for the forgiveness of sins. Yeah. In one of your programs, you suggested that people go back and check their baptisms to see sh- to make sure it was done correctly. That's correct. I did, I did just that, and all that I could find was a certificate confirming my baptism. Because that's all you got in the Catholic Church, a piece of paper. Amen. The Catholics don't baptize correctly. No. The Catholics have never baptized correctly. Amen. Uh, it is not the will of God to be baptized the method of, of the Catholic Church. I, I want to demonstrate this. Brother Gibbs, if you do me a favor, brother, go in my office, and uh, in, my, in my bathroom there's a cup. Put a little bit of water in it, brother, please. <laughs> Would you do that for me, brother, and bring it out? I want to uh, I thank God for this old television because you really can let folks see. Yes, I want to show you the way the Catholics baptize, and we're going to compare their methods of baptism with the Bible. Is that all right? Yes, we'll be going to compare it with the Bible. All right, read on, Dan. I did just that and could not find, I I could only find a certificate confirming my baptism, but nothing saying whether I was baptized in the name of Jesus Christ. (laughs) You won't never find it. My God, you can search from here to doomsday. Doomsday hits you first. That's right. All right. My question is, would I be out of line with the scriptures if I were not, if I were to be baptized again to ensure I have the proper baptism? No, uh, you must be in keeping with the scriptures. Uh, number one, in the 19th chapter of the book of Acts of the Apostles, uh, those that followed John the Baptist were baptized in John's day. That's right. But after Jesus came along, John the Baptist's baptism was out of date. And they got baptized over the 19th chapter of the book of Acts of the Apostles. Read that quickly. Acts 19. And then we had demonstrate this for the Catholic viewers. Thank you, brother. Acts 19 and beginning verse 1. Yeah. And it came to pass that while Apollos was at Corinth, uh-huh. all having passed through the upper coast came to Ephesus. Mm-hmm. Finding certain disciples, he said unto them, Have you received the Holy Ghost since ye believed? Read quick. And they said unto him, We have not so much as heard whether there be any Holy Ghost. What was the question? And he said unto them, Unto what then were ye baptized? That's my question. Amen. To every religion on the earth today. Unto what then were How ye were ye baptized? And they said unto John's baptism. Because John's baptism. Then said Paul, John verily baptized with the baptism of repentance, mm-hmm. saying unto the people that they should believe on him which should come after him. And who was that on? That is on Christ Jesus. What were they respond? When they heard this. When they heard this. They were baptized in the name of the Lord Jesus. You see, these folk were baptized once before. Amen. But when Jesus come along, that abolished all these other baptisms. Right. You see, you only had three baptisms in water in the Bible. Mm-hmm. The days of Moses, the days of John the Baptist, right. and what Jesus gave the apostles. That's right. When they heard this, they were, baptized they were baptized in the name of the Lord Jesus. Now, the Catholics sprinkled. Amen. But the scripture teaches us to be married. Now, let's see what the Catholics do. Mm-hmm. Uh, Brother Sean, bring your son up, son. You got him in your hand. Bring him up. Bring your son up. That's the way the Catholics do it, you know. I want the camera to zoom in on this good. Hold, hold him like, you know, like a little newborn. Now, I don't have a bowl. So, uh, we'll make this the bowl. I don't want to be sure that none of you priests ever have an excuse for being a fool ever again. Amen. Now, you parents come up and bring your children. And after the priest do done saying something in Latin and heaven knows what else, rest, son, you'll be all right. The parents come up all happy. Uh, my child has been baptized today. Where, where's your wife? Where's your wife at? Come on up. I want to make this complete. Come on up, sister. Come on up, baby, because you got a happy father. You got to have a happy mother. That's the way the Catholics do it. Come on up, sister. You come along in the Catholic church and the husband and the wife and they got the child. And you're so happy. And the preacher stand there saying, the mumble, jumble, mumble, jumble, jumble, mumble, 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 and a few jumbles and the mumbles at that. After that, he in the bowl. That's right. In the name of the Father. 
in the name of the Son, in the name of the Holy Ghost. Now, give him here. That's the way you Catholics do it. Amen. Now, if I do it like the Bible, back up, mother and father. If this is water, listen to what the scripture says in Romans chapter 6. In Romans chapter 6 and at verse 4. Follow me. Romans 6 and verse 4. Says what? Therefore we are buried with him by baptism into death. So if I do it the Bible way, if this is water, Amen. he's going down in it. That's right. That's buried. 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 Is that right? Amen. That's being buried. That's right. So, you're not holding your son at an upright toilet bowl. Right. And the preacher's just dipping his fingers, right. waiting his head. Mm -hmm. This whole body must be buried in water because the burying of the body in water is symbolic to the burial of the body of the Son of God in the tomb. Okay. Go ahead, brother. You understand? Jesus right. was buried in the grave. That's right. They didn't just sprinkle dirt on his head. No, no. So every Catholic from Pope down Amen. to the altar boy, mm -hmm. the entire Catholic diocese, right. the entire Catholic organization Amen. must, must, right. must back That's right. to water. I don't care if you're a millionaire. Amen. If you're black as a sheep, Amen. white as snow, Amen. yellow as butter, or clear as water. That's right. Every Catholic follower was baptized wrong. Amen. Amen. Did you hear that? Amen. I said, not some of you, not some of you. Everybody in the Catholic religion was baptized wrong. That's right. Was baptized wrong. Because the Bible says, Therefore we are buried with him. Well, sprinkle with him. Buried with him. Sprinkle. Buried. Sprinkle. Buried. Sprinkle. Buried. Buried. Buried with him by with baptism. Him by baptism. Into, death. into death. You got to be buried. Buried, man. Your whole body must go down in the water, not stand there with your child dressed in white lace. No. And dropping a little bit of water on his or her little forehead. That's right. Not only that, you must repent. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. Amen. The Bible command repentance. That's right. Amen. You got to believe. Amen. How can an infant believe? That's right. That's right. Jesus said, He that believeth and is baptized. How can an infant believe? The infant doesn't even know it's here. That's right. That's right. That's right. They got to hear something. Amen. Then when it consider what it hears, That's right. then it gives the chance for belief to be activated. That's right. Then you must repent. Jesus said, except you repent, you shall all likewise perish. That's right. Amen. They didn't tell you to drag a bunch of people to some little bowl and let yeah. some fellow with his collar turn just like he know the Bible backward, right. throw water on your head. That's right. The priest, the altar boy, Amen. the archbishop, the pope, whether it's Pope Paul, Pope Henry, or Pope Harvey. And a great company of the priests. Yeah, listen, listen. That's what holiness offers. Amen. That's what holiness demands. Amen. Listen now what the scripture says, priest. Acts chapter 6 and at verse 7. Priest. And a great company. A great company. Of the priests. Of the priests. Were obedient. Were obedient. To the faith. I told you. That's Amen. right. Priest. That's right. You got to come behind that, from behind that screen. From behind that closet, Amen. you got to get up off that altar, boy. That's right. Amen. That's right. And what you got to do here? And a great company of the priests. How much of the company? A great company. How much of them? A great company. Got to do what? Of the priests were obedient to the faith. The faith required that you repent of your sins Amen. and go down in water in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. The faith required. Who faith required? God. God's faith. That's right. One faith. That's right. One Lord, one faith. Faith meaning one established belief Amen. and one baptism. Amen. All right, Dan, the man, let's get moving. This question is 